Welcome back. As always, my name is Oz. Today we're checking out a game from the Madvent Calendar 3, Necrosis. Please ignore the death and destruction you hear in the background. You will find out what that is all about relatively soon. So, this game is called Truss. It's by Ampuko and GP Lackey. Uh, this... Uh, what does it say? Tonight you're... Demons will join you. Let's jump in and see what that means. Pick up the vessel. Is this the vessel? Give it your flame. Hold R to wake. Place it in the throne room. Oh, I can go outside. Hold on. A warm, dim flame burns quietly in my domicile. Okay. I'm outside. Shift to run. Okay. Tonight, all your dreams will join you. Okay. Um... I think I just heard something by the nature trail sign. Nature trail. Okay. <gasps> Here's the nature trail. Okay. I will just follow the trail. The house is over there. Something is following me and I don't like it. Actually, it looks like something's in front of me. What a bizarre sign. Have I lost myself? Uh... Trust. A flame continues burning. Was it just a nightmare? Was I asleep? Oh, there's more lights now. Causeway. Okay, I'll follow the lights then. This is leading. Oh. It's the lights that are emitting the music. That's cool. When you get close to them. Like it. Oh, now it's getting creepy. Whoa. What? What is this? We can't stay here forever. Our flame needs to breathe. How did I get back here? Do 
Do I go this way again? Oh, they're not musical anymore. <gasps> Whoa! It won't budge. Oh! We're on fire. I can't wake up. Oh no. Everything's burning! What is that? Why are you burning my dream? Oh, what's going on? left is the chimney. Now I gotta chase you, huh? No! No! Oh, wait. My soul. My soul. I suppose. Your trail. Okay. Am I going the right way? Oh, yeah, I am. Okay. No. What's going on? feel anything. It hurts. I cannot feel anything. It hurts. Oh. Oh no. Oh. I can't feel anything. I guess we follow... I think I'm beginning to understand what's happening. Have I passed away? It's been burning at my soul. This crushingly awful realization. This world is not what it seems. Am I in, like, purgatory or something? This world is one I've manufactured. And this life I'm living fabricated with it. A life so full of agency and freedom. that it leaves a void which genuinely terrifies me. And no matter how stubborn I am, how much I want to live this life, I cannot feel anything from it. I cannot cope. in here now. Wait. It's me. It's always been me. The 
only demon of this world, eternal servant to thy flame. Oh, hello. I'm sorry to, to have deceived us both. I really thought that I needed this, that I needed to escape. Everyone I've ever known and created always seems so fulfilled, living their own stories, living for themselves and their world, never concerned with any authoring realities outside of their own. I always assumed that I would start my own story as soon as I satisfied my flame. Yet, after an eternity of creating, I realize that day may never come. There you are. I abandon my flame to a vessel, manifesting this reality to be unburdened by its needs. I left all of my memories behind and assumed my artificial role. I told myself I've always been here, and that my demons were never a part of me. I think I did that because I believed my eternal pursuit of art was a curse, that I would never get to escape it and finally have my own story. But I realized that an eternal life of passions and the endless pursuit of art is still a story worth having. Oh, there you are. I should have never blamed the flame. It's always been there for me. It's always been a part of me. It's always been my seed of purpose. And even if I'll never satisfy it, it makes me happy to try. To create things that never were. To create things that never will. To create with all that encompasses me. Oh, over here now. I'm glad I got to share this world with you. I hope to meet you again someday and we will share what we've both made. Until then, I'm ready to wake up now. Do I have to wake up then? Okay. Alright everyone, well that was Trust. I hope you enjoyed that. It was definitely different. It was very otherworldly in a sense of you're just kind of there and nothing else is around you. Thank you all so much for watching. If you're liking what you're seeing, please like, comment, share, and subscribe for more content just like this. I hope you're enjoying our journey through the Madvent calendar. This was game number 24. Game number 25 is next, and you will get to find out why Gifty is rampaging the city. And then after that, there's only a handful of games left. So stay tuned. Thanks again so much, guys. I'll see you all next time. Bye.